Well, it is apparently the video scene around the country and hitting national headlines, a uh, transformer bursting into flames at Hoover Dam. 24 hours later, visitors were back on the tour as crews worked to determine just what happened. Our senior reporter Joe Muller has the latest. Visitors say they were happy to still be able to come out here to the Hoover Dam after seeing that viral video of the fire. Crews could be seen at the base of the dam inspecting that transformer. Pretty wild. Getting all the shots. <laughs> it's pretty, pretty beautiful. Every year. You can get the power lines back there. Millions of visitors like Mark Story and his son come to the Hoover Dam. It's pretty crazy. I wish I was here to see it, actually. Many knew about the viral video of the transformer fire that happened early Tuesday. They heard there was an explosion out here at the Hoover Dam. Eddie Jane is here with a group of wrestlers from Ohio. We weren't sure if we'd be able to come out, but uh, it seemed like everything was okay. The group went on a tour Wednesday and saw crews at work inside. Yeah, we were actually able to go down and see the generator where uh, that it blew up. They had it all pulled out and they were able to work on it. The Bureau of Reclamation says crews were cleaning and inspecting the failed equipment Wednesday. They are looking at the transformer to determine what led up to the connection failure. They did not say how much the damage would cost to fix. It's one of the bucket list items that I've been wanting to do. Jody McCollum is from Georgia. I heard about it on the news. I think I was on Facebook actually. And she and her husband didn't think twice about visiting the dam. I thought it was not going to deter us from coming out here. So While the video looks alarming, Turn it on for me. people were happy it didn't cause damage to the popular destination. I know it creates power. I don't really know how. Story and his son cool. were amazed by the dam. It's quite a quite an achievement. Officials from the Bureau of Reclamation say the fire was put out quick. In just about 30 minutes, they say the fire suppression system and the fire brigade that responded stopped it from spreading. Reporting at the Hoover Dam, I'm Jim Moore.